After all the buildup and all the hype, November the 1st is finally here. It's Brett Favre's return to Lambeau Field. Oh, the anticipation for this day and this very moment. We welcome you to sold out Lambeau Field in Green Bay, Wisconsin. The six and one Minnesota Vikings come to town to take on the four and two Packers. the reception out of the backfield. Third and five. Caught. That's a first down for Donald Driver. Fumbled by Rodgers in the backfield, but he dives right on top of it to convert on this third down. Ball hit as he threw. First down reception. Coming down the line to make the tackle, Clay Matthews. Minnesota punts. Second and ten, a screen to Ryan Grant, and sniffed out beautifully by Greenway. Third and thirteen, Rodgers throws high. Perhaps somewhat lost in all the Brett Favre hype returning to Lambeau Field in Green Bay is the importance of this game in the NFC North. Minnesota already a win over Green Bay this season. And should they win again, in essence, it's a three-game divisional lead. Ball is loose. Still loose. And it looks like the Packers have it in the 20. They do. They give it to Grant, cuts it back to the inside and bangs his one. They pitch it to Grant, and he is slammed down at the. Rodgers on third and five, rolls, and down he goes. That'll be a loss of two. So after getting the turnover, Giving the Packers the short field and not allowing them to get to the end zone. 37-yard field goal try is good by Crosby. But it turns into a 37-yard field goal by Crosby. So now the electrifying rookie out of the University of Florida, Percy Harvin, brings it across the 30. Harvin already a pair of touchdown returns this season. Inside the 30, inside the 20, all the way down to the 14. Great open field tackle made by Nick Barnett. And now a flag comes in 
Some extracurricular activity after the tackle was made. In the dead ball period, personal foul, headbutt, defense number 97. This penalty be assessed half the distance to the goal. Chester Taylor. Yeah, there's always a little jawing going on. You got to show a little restraint. Peterson. He's dropped at the 10 yard line. Peterson inside the five. They run it. Very close to the goal line. Did he get in? Yes, touchdown Adrian Peterson. So after struggling so mightily inside the red zone a week ago against Pittsburgh, two big turnovers. They're down in a long yard for the Packers. And Rodgers out of the shotgun, fakes it, and is looking down the field, being chased by Edwards, who got him all the way back to the 17. Eight times he was sacked in the first meeting. If nothing else, I mean, you're giving up yardage on field position. Jamar Johnson from a 28-yard line and a pretty good return. Already had a big kickoff. Third and four, blitz coming. Favre gets it away. Catch made by Harvin here at Lambeau over a 16-year period. Pump fake one way and throws the other way, and a catch is made by Barian inside the 25. That quite simply, they couldn't do in previous years. Favre appeared to underthrow that ball, and it was still caught by Rice. Seventh play of the drive. Favre guns it over the middle. It's caught and into the end zone for Vasante Shanko. He might be 40, but after getting his arm surgically repaired at the end of last season, and his team leads 14-3. Rodgers again under huge pressure and Jared Allen got him that's three sacks without giving the opposing team a short field Rodgers throws and batted down laying out to get a paw and it was Greenway but that's an awfully solid group Minnesota figures to get great field position and dropped on their last two possessions to score two touchdowns. Peterson into the open field and still on his feet inside the 30 and finally caught by Al Harris close to the 15 yard line. Incomplete, he had an eye on Berrien. Berrien wanted a flag. The pass to the end zone by Favre, so now Longwell on for a 29-yard field goal try. You know, yardage because neutral of Neutral zone infraction, defense, stepped into the neutral zone, causing an offensive player to false start. Five-yard penalty will remain fourth down. I'm not sure if Peterson got it. They elected to run the ball rather than play action, and Peterson is denied the first down. What a huge swing for Green Bay. Green Bay has to get a first down here to get any momentum at all. <laughs> Juggling the football was Driver. Rodgers can't complete the Driver. And it is a reception. But he's not having one of them here in this first half. They fake it to Grant before Rodgers can even look up. He is sacked again. A pretty good level. Not quite the player that he was a few years back, but still a force. Third and 12. Rodgers steps up, throws too tall. Pretty good tailgate day there. Not, not bad. bad. Not bad. 
Five on first down, a quick hit to Rice. He's across midfield. Quick throw to Harvin, bounces off one tackle. Rice to the 22, another first down. Taught a lot of these guys a lot of football in a short period of time. Surprising call there on second down. They hand it off to Chester Taylor. You know, obviously in passing situations, knowing that the Packers are expecting that, tried to sneak a draw in. Five. Lays it off for Taylor, who dropped it at the 20. Good snap, good hold. That is Longwell did for so many years wearing a Packer uniform. Third and 17, a three-man rush. And Favre's going to pick that apart all day long. Favre and the Vikings at midfield on first down. And Favre to throw it. Unbelievable protection. Throws into traffic, the catch made by Harvin. He cuts it back the other way and into the end zone. Touchdown, Percy Harvin. Dom Capers refuses to do that. Rodgers will put it up. And a wide open receiver is Greg Jennings all the way down to the Minnesota 40 yard line. Third and five. Rodgers looking, has room to get a first down and does. Lays it off for Kuhn out of the backfield. Four man rush. Empty backfield. Quarterback draw. And Rodgers took a shot in the back. And Rodgers sacked back at the eight. Jared Allen again. You can't take the sacks that he has taken. 26 yard field goal try is good by Mason Crosby. Aaron Rodgers under tremendous pressure. Split kick. And out on the cross and the ball. Football is loose. And it looks like the Packers have recovered down at the bottom of that pile. They have Brian Robinson. A.J. Hawk stripped it away before Nick Collins covered it up. So now Rodgers again in trouble. Rolls, throws, caught first down by Jennings. Still a lot of football to go. Eight minute mark in the third quarter. That catch is made by Donald Driver. Someone who is a real tough matchup with virtually anyone they've got defensively. Rodgers to the end zone. Touchdown, Spencer Havener. And steps in here, and he has really provided a spark, not just here in this game, but the last couple of games for this team. Nearly intercepted. Prominent figure, but most of those have been the check down variety like we just saw. Blitz coming, five steps up, and it's batted in the air, and incomplete. Incomplete on a throw to Shanko next week, 8 a.m. Pacific. That's a special starting time. Protection this time and across the middle the catch is made to the 45 inside the 40 still on his feet Is James Jones just his seventh catch of the year, and that's a big one Blitz coming Jennings 
to the 15. Down to the 10. Havener again, touchdown, and the game is on in Green Bay. That's a versatile and valuable guy. And paying huge dividends now these last two weeks. Percy Harvin trying to change the momentum. Trying to turn the corner across midfield, and some of that momentum comes back to the Viking side. And you see here, Al Harris is again. Five fires again to Harvin, who makes a catch down to the 22. Chester Taylor. Inside the five. Five on third and goal. Throws a touchdown to the tight end, Jeff Dugan. Third touchdown pass today for Brett Favre. Yeah, you pack everybody up, make it look like Ron. A team that has become quite close in a short amount of time since Favre signed in the third week of August. Ryan Grant a first down carry. That's a game the Vikings a year ago can't win. But yet they won it because of the arm of Brett Favre. Good protection for Rodgers. And I don't know that anybody thought that he would make as big a difference this early. In a return game, yes. But he's been, he's been big in the uh, receiving game also. Rodgers tiptoes out of trouble. And he's going to run it. Still on his feet inside the 20, the 15, and steps out of bounds at the 12 yard line. That's a flag all the way. And a touchdown reception by Jennings. The flag came down long before the ball was ever in the end zone. We have to wait the official verdict. He got tangled up with Tama, did Jennings in the corner of the end zone. Right through the fingertips. Peterson. Peterson across midfield and tackled from behind. Great protection. Then it collapses at the end. Favre could not find an open receiver and took a hit from Matthew. Thrown behind the intended receiver, Harvin. One sided in the opening half in favor of Minnesota. Green Bay's had the ball four possessions in this half and scored on every possession. Breaking a tackle is Kuhn, and he's out to the 34. Bad snap. Rodgers able to get his hands on it and then throws complete over the middle to midfield to Donald Driver. Penalty flag down behind the line of scrimmage. Drivers shaken up after making the catch. Personal foul, roughing the passer, defense number 91. And being able to find Driver, and there's the, the hit by Ray Edwards. Blitz coming. Rodgers gets it away. Donald Driver checks back in for the Packers. And Rodgers. Is that a sack they're saying? Jared Allen is saying sack, and the officials agree. Yeah, he went down on a knee, and... Blitz coming again. They pick it up. Rodgers to driver, and nearly intercepted by Benny Sapp. 
51 yards. He's hit on one of three from 50 and beyond this year. No good. Favre gets the ball back with 5.38 to go. And he's throwing on first down. A screen to Adrian Peterson, who rushes down the sideline, cuts it back to the inside, and tackled at the 14-yard line. Chester Taylor caught from behind by Matthews. Five, a short drop, catch is made, and close to the end zone, touchdown Bernard Berrien. Fourth touchdown pass of the game for number four. You know, this game, the first time, a lot of yards picked up by Green Bay in a similar situation when they were down two scores, and I don't think Leslie Frazier wants to see that happen again. Rodgers throws, and it's incomplete. He had an eye on Jennings, who is well covered by Carl. For the Green Bay Packer fans. Catch made over the middle by James Jones, and that is the first down to keep this drive alive with 2.51 left. Penalty flag all the way back at the 30-yard line. Holding offense number 78. And he's trying to build a legacy of his own and prove to a lot of people that he is the franchise. And complete on third down. Played well for O number four when they were on the team together. Rodgers on fourth down. Let's it fly incomplete and that ought to do it. And now it'll expire and the Vikings go to seven and one. The Packers slip to four and three. Former Packers Ryan Longwell and Brett Favre celebrating the 38-26 win. Troy enjoyed it. We send you now bonus coverage to the desert where Chris Myers and Brian Billick will take you home from the Panthers and the Arizona Cardinals. So long, everybody.